AMD manages to keep themselves in the headlines, and today is no different with the first performance benchmark of AMD's upcoming Radeon Pro W6800 Workstation graphics card has leaked out on the Geekbench database. The benchmark result was spotted by Leakbench and also details the specifications of that upcoming product. Now yesterday, AMD teased a Radeon Pro W6000 series graphics card based on the RDNA 2 GPU architecture. And we've been getting leaks on the graphics card for quite a while now, but it looks like the grand reveal is coming next week. The GPU has benchmarked within the Geekbench OpenCL test, posting a score of 137,230 points, which puts it slightly faster than the Radeon RX 6800 and Nvidia's RTX 3070 graphics cards. As for the test platform, the AMD Radeon Pro W6800 was tested with an AMD Ryzen 9 5900X system which features 16GB of DDR4 memory. The GPU itself is configured with 32GB of G6 VRAM and operates across a 256-bit wide bus interface. Considering that AMD is using 16 gigabits per second chips on our DNA2 lineup, we can expect a bandwidth of around 512 gigabytes per second in addition to the 128 megabytes of infinity cache. Now the compute unit count was reported as 30, but that's incorrect as that would be the total number of cores at 1920. But it could be possible that the software is just reading the core count incorrectly and it's actually a 60 compute unit for a total of 3,840 stream processors. A previous leak confirmed that the card features the Navi 21 GL SKU, which is similar to the graphics chip found in the Radeon RX 6800 and that would also explain why the performance is so close to that part. The maximum core clock was reported at 2.55 GHz and it should be noted that the Radeon RX 6000 series gaming graphics cards have far better driver optimization right now than we currently release Radeon Pro W6000 cards. So that might explain the better performance, although the Pro 6800 does end up being faster than the Navi 21 based Radeon RX 6800. In terms of design, we only got a glimpse of the card from the teaser, but it looks like it will be retaining the blue and silver color scheme. AMD has gone with a slightly updated shroud design and still relies on a blower style cooler. Now this card is dual slot and features a back plate that covers half of the PCB. As for display outputs, AMD will be providing up to six mini display ports for great workstation connectivity. Now the performance numbers don't make it seem like the card is going to be closer to the 6800 XT in specifications than it is the 6800. Now AMD is working on several W6000 Pro graphics cards since we've already seen a 16 gigabyte variant for both PC and Apple platforms and also confirmed that the new Navi 23 based Radeon Pro W6600M GPUs and Radeon Pro W6900X in earlier leaks. Now, the Radeon Pro lineup is expected to be unveiled on June 8th, so just a few days from now. And I want to thank you for making it to the end of this video. If you like what you've seen here and you like getting news daily, make sure you hit that subscribe button down there in the corner and if you've missed out on news in the past and you want to catch those, check out one of these videos over here.